party tonight Cause it feels alright There's a party tonight Party tonight Cause Welcome everyone to a brand new Premiere Pro tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to pre-render videos for smooth playback. Before we get right into this tutorial, make sure to check out my Patreon, where I got exclusive benefits from early access to sponsorships. So, make sure to check that out. Also, check, check out my website. And don't forget to use code John John Games to get five dollars off on my YouTube starter kit so without further ado let's get right into the tutorial what you gotta do is open up Premiere Pro if you do not have Premiere Pro there will be a link in the description where you can get you can get Premiere Pro once you get it open up when you first launch it you have a you have a pop-up to create a new project if you don't have that screen pop-up what you're going to do is go to File, New, Project, or Control alt n all together. Then you, what you want to do is create a new sequence. Go to File, or to create a new sequence, you need to go to File, again, New, then Sequence, or Control n And then that sequence. Then drag and drop one of your gameplays or footage whatever you want to call it I already drag, already drag and drop one of my in I, I'm gonna use my old Fortnite clip as an example now what I'm gonna do is drag and drop this uh, footage onto the timeline and I will get a warning about the mismatch keep existing I'm just gonna ignore that message nothing need to worry about see my footage is Extremely zoomed in. I wanted to fix that before we pre rent uh, get rid of this red line. We're gonna fix our footage. F footage. I already do that. We gotta left click on our footage, right click on the footage. Then we're gonna scroll down until we see scale to frame size. Alright, to pre render to pre render video. On our timeline, you see this red line. Let's see if it. You see this red line? It tells you. This is where the pre render comes in. Make sure you click on. Left click on your. Your footage. Or pre render, you gotta go to sequence. Where's the sequence? Then select render in to out. You click that, it will pre-render, it depends the length on, the length of your footage. It will tell you how many, how long it take to pre-render the footage. It will tell you estimated time left. It just depends, it just depends the length of the footage you have. So we're going to wait this out. I'm going to fast forward this and we'll be right back. 20 minutes later. Alright, this Fortnite clip I have, it, it almost rendered ten, uh, 5,000 frames. And after that, this red line should be switched to green. And yes, it will play automatically after the pre-render. And there you go. And should, and this what we should have as a result. That's so what we should have as a result. There we go. So that's how to pre-render videos in Premiere Pro. So if there's anything you want me to do in Premiere Pro, let me know in the comments below. I will get that video done for you. So that's why I have. That's why I have. That's simply how to do it. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to slap a like on this video. Make sure to subscribe with the notification bell. Click. Make sure. 
Make sure you don't miss a single video upload stream on Premiere. I'll see you guys in a brand new video.